there's this concept that uh, we at Moda think about and talk about a lot called data poverty. It's mm. not it's not the difference of you know which communities you know have access to data or not. It's the fact that there are some communities who are not measuring themselves. Or they're not producing data. Right. right? Yeah. Exactly. They're not producing data. Right. Well, and so from that standpoint, um, we always think about data at Moda is data doesn't lie, but it can be biased. <laughs> right. And so if we're doing a citywide uh, analytic on 301 service requests on ABC, and there are pockets of communities in New York City that aren't using 311 to submit service requests, then obviously our analytic is biased. But the data is not lying, but the analytic is biased. So again, ensuring, keeping with the statement about um, people using 311, um, at, the more you use and the more communities use 311, the more you're able to produce this data about yourselves and you're able to get measured and then um, city and even people within the community know more about the community so that you can begin to build solutions and solve problems um, 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 within the community from the community leaders and so on and so forth. So again, this, this, this thread of you guys being the owners of this data, and I think I agree with the point that um, not everyone likes to read spreadsheets, but you know what? <laughs> Everyone should. Because when I was moving into the computer science space when I was a fourth grader in Brooklyn, New York, Bed-Stuy, um, there weren't people like me who were doing computer science and learning how to program. But you know what? Um, through my parents, I understood the importance of doing that and not, didn't want to leave it to other people to be the creators of technology and computer science and I just be the consumer. And so, you know what, it's very important that we also, the spreadsheet readers of the data and the, the um, raw, reading the raw data and so on and so forth. So we just don't want to always, I think it's very good um, that experts are doing that, but we should also learn in our communities to ensure, to create experts as well.